Hi, my name is Jeffrey Levinson, and I'm one of the customer advocates here at Malili. Today, I'm going to show you how to create and run an image template project. The first thing that we're going to want to do is head into a document. From here, we're going to create a template document that will be the basis for the rest of our documents. This project is great to run when you have forms that have information in the same exact areas. For example, this W9. The rest of the documents that we're going to be running are W9s. So all of the information that we're going to be redacting today is in the same spot. As you can see, I've gone ahead and redacted the name and the social security number on this document. Now before we head out of this document to start our project, we're going to want to make sure that we go ahead and notate or just copy our control number here. Once we've done that, I'm going to go ahead and return to the document list. I'll head over to my blackout tab and then I'll head into our projects. From here, I'm going to click the create new project button and I'm going to choose image template. I'll go ahead and I'll put in a quick name here for my project. I'm going to search here for the save search that I made earlier for these documents. I'll choose the primary markup set and I'm going to go ahead and paste in that control number that we went ahead and notated earlier. From here, I'll go ahead and create the project. Once the project's created, our run screen will go ahead and load, and we can click Run to go ahead and run the project. If you do see that you know, something is wrong here and you need to edit something, you can always go ahead and click the pencil button to edit something. From here, though, we're going to click Run. Now, once the project is running, you'll see this spinning little circle here. It just means that it's queuing everything up and getting everything ready. Sometimes, if the project is large, you'll get this project bar here. It'll show you documents prepared as well as the documents completed as it moves along. Once you get to the completion page, which we're at now, we have our documents marked up, our pages marked up, our markups placed on the documents, as well as the history and the details of the project. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on the Save Search link here just so I can get into all of our documents to show you all of the results, including the template. I'll go ahead and I will head into that template that we made just so you can see that it's the same thing I showed you earlier. But the most important thing and what I'm going to do now is navigate over to the next document and you're going to see that all of the markups are placed in the exact same spot. Again, this is a great project to run. If you have forms that are identical and need redactions in the same exact place. If you have any questions or concerns, you can always email in to support at Thanks again, and thank you for watching.